Moral of the story is, let's all have my maha every day. <laughs> definitely, definitely, multiple times a day. <laughs>、hey、tribe, Stephanie Dixon here for Green is a New Black TV, your guide to conscious living. Today we are in Hong Kong and we are speaking about nutrition and all things delicious with Hiren Baran, the founder of My Maha. Hiren, thanks so much for joining us today. Thanks for having me. Yeah, super excited. So tell us a little bit about your journey so far and how you got to where you are now. Okay, so My Maha is a plant-based company. We make our own line of organic plant-based health consumables. The idea for My Maha came about seven years ago when I was living in New York, living a super stressed life. I was a finance analyst, not sleeping enough, eating poorly, and then I slowly started to discover health、um, and nutrition. Started incorporating superfoods into my diet and saw a massive difference.、Um, the trouble with that was that it was taking too much time. I was spending like ten minutes every morning, like getting ready. Prepping my food, prepping my breakfast. So I thought to myself, there had to be an easier way for me to get everything and all the nutrients that I need、um, in one step, right? Something that takes like two seconds a day. Yeah, that's amazing. So it really came out of your own personal need and being in that crazy life. And I think so many of us can really relate to that push and pull, especially at this age. <laughs> you know, like our lives are really crazy and it doesn't give up. So that's amazing that we can get that. So what is your the bigger mission, I guess, with my mom? So we want to make it as easy as possible for people to be healthy. So all our products are streamlined and tightly created, and everything is also plant-based to nurture nature, right? And to like preserve the environment. Starting with what's on your plate is the easiest way to do it. Also because you do it every day, so these steps really add up. I think that's amazing. So it really fits into our crazy life that we have going.、Right、exactly.、Now. <laughs> exactly. And so, what do you really hope to see in the next few years in wellness or in nutrition? Okay, I hope that everyone aligns with their true, authentic self, right? So when you align with your true, authentic self, you make decisions that really feel good for you, like decisions in life, decisions with eating, everything, right? And then, I, and then you can fulfill your potential. Yeah, I think that's really beautiful. I think it definitely comes from within, and that's. That's a great place to start, and I know that you have a very different view,、um, maybe to kind of what's out there with all the health, health and wellness advice and diets and all this kind of stuff. So maybe you can share that with us. Okay, I think that people should eat whatever they want.、Um, start where you are. I think if your body is telling you to eat something, it means that you should probably eat it. Yeah,、right. do whatever feels good. Eat what you like. <laughs> so you you talk about superfoods, which is really where your whole journey started with nutrition when you were in New York. So maybe you can unpack that a little bit for us. Like, what、yeah. are we talking about when we're talking about superfoods? Superfoods is basically any food that can be found in nature as it is. Nothing with like additives, preservatives, and anything from nature is usually very nutritionally dense, and it、mm. serves your body. So that's what a superfood is. Amazing. Okay, so let's talk about the superfoods that you feature in your My Maha products.、Mm -hmm. What are they? Our products have to fall into three categories, right? Boosters, nutrients, and anti-inflammatory substances that help regulate your body、um, and help it fight from stressful city living. For boosters, we have our matcha, so it gives you energy, but it's not as acidic as caffeine from coffee. And then we have our nutrients, which is a blend of eleven different kinds of superfoods, like moringa leaves, carrots, baobab, things from all around the world, and That is your two servings of fruits and vegetables a day,、mm. and it's also your 30% of your recommended iron intake. And then we have granola for people who are really like pressed for time. It has matcha and your superfoods in your morning cereal. So if、Amazing. you have no time, then just eat that in the morning, and you're you're good to go. And I think you know we were talking about iron deficiency in women, and it's、yeah. actually really high, especially、mm. in Asia. So maybe you can tell us a little bit about that and how your product helps. More than 50% of women actually suffer from some form of iron deficiency,、mm. and most of us don't know because we don't get tested. It's not the symptoms aren't usually there, but we develop. The green superfood powder with a lot of spinach in it to target iron deficiency in women. When you have an iron deficiency, you have low energy.、Um, some people can't wake up in the morning. You get tired. You suffer from fainting spells or just general lethargy, right? Which you can't really pinpoint, but you feel like you're not 100%. Okay, so moral of the story is. Let's all have my maha every day. <laughs> definitely, definitely, multiple times a day. <laughs>、awesome. So, one of our favorite questions to ask people is, "What would Mother Nature say if she could speak right now?" I think she would say, "Love yourself enough to love your neighbor and the world around you." That's so beautiful. I love that. I love yourself. Amazing. What is your life mantra or wedge of wisdom that you live by? I try to live by the mantra of、um, "Love is the answer, no matter the question." Beautiful. 
And so for our audience watching, you know, obviously we're talking about nutrition, we're talking about how to live better and, and love more in our lives, but what is one or two key actions that people can take today to, you know, have better nutrition or, or to live better? I think just stopping to enjoy your meal and maybe having like at least 20 bites or 10 to 20 bites when you chew your food, I think that's a really good first step. I'm not telling you to like change what you eat, just really be conscious that you're eating. Yeah. Right, because you do it several times a day and like sometimes you just don't know you're eating. Yeah, you're just scuffing that food down. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So just really take the time to chew and breathe and you know, I'll be okay. Amazing, so eat consciously. That's what we're learning today. Well, thank you Hiren so much for joining us thank and you. thank you for watching. I hope you learned something today so you can live more consciously tomorrow. Mm -hmm.